It's taste testing time again, and we're going to try one we've all been looking forward to. This is barbecued beef. It's shredded, and it's in a sauce. And today we're going to try this on some King's Hawaiian buns. And uh, Janet made up some coleslaw we're going to put on there, too. So this is uh, five entrees. And you can see that there are some big pieces, lots of shredded pieces in here. Some usual kind of stringiness to it. And I'm just going to blop a little of this on here. Or a and lot. Then, <laughs> mm, well, that's not a lot. The buns are kind of small. So we have extra buns. That's a good thing. And then I'm going to put a little of this on here. Okay. Sean, why don't you serve yourself up? It's like a picnic. This is good picnic food. Oh boy. Oh, oh. you made a sloppy Joe out Gonna of that. Gonna need one, napkins. Joe. Yeah, it is. It's a, it's a me too. It's a wetter shredded beef than I anticipated. Um, it's like a sloppy Joe made with shredded beef instead of ground beef. Um, oh, that is sloppy, John. Yeah, well, I put way too much on it. <laughs> <laughs> like you said, the buns are small. They're like sliders. <laughs> Good excuse. Mmm. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Mmm. -hmm. Whoa. I'm going to give thumbs way up on this one. Yeah. Okay, Jen, are you ready? I am ready. I've really been wanting to try this one. So I, too, made a huge heaping plate. <laughs> and Luna's at my feet just in case, but I'm going to try it first. That's good. Ooh. That's really good. Mm. You just had a taste, too. I'm, I'm tasting it. Don't, no, don't go anywhere, Jen. <laughs> well, I gotta sit down to stuff my face. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna do a, a, a taste on this by itself. Um, That's all I did. Ooh. That's really good. That is perhaps one of the tastiest MREs ever. It's great flavor. There's just tons of sauce. And I'm gonna make a sandwich with some coleslaw. Are you going to put coleslaw on yours, Jess? No. No? I don't want coleslaw. <laughs> I need to get a fork. I think I'm going to taste it just by itself, too. This may be one of the most boring taste tests we've ever done because everybody likes this so much. We are so quiet. <laughs> Happily munching. Mm. Look at these people. Mm. Munch, munch, munch. Oh, Jess's first bite. It's good. I think with the sauce, it makes it really, like, the meat really moist. I thought it was going to be, like, just a dry shredded beef, kind of like the chicken breast. But, like, it's really moist and flavorful. It's good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's that good. Mm. I really like this one. How'd you like it with the coleslaw? You really want me to quit eating and answer questions? <laughs> <laughs> this is really damn good. It's good. Yeah. It's good by itself, <laughs> but mm -hmm. even... Mm -hmm. This is one... This is one of those MREs where you could serve this and pretend you made it in your own kitchen. Yeah. It, I was just difficult. thinking, you know what this would be fun to do? I've had a request because I did my Thanksgiving video last year with the tray pack. I'm thinking like buying five or six of these, putting them in a crock pot, <laughs> heating them up, and doing the King's Hawaiian sliders and stuff for like the Civil War, Oregon, Oregon State, which is a no-brainer. Oregon's going to win, but... <laughs> I'm having some friends over, and that, that would be kind of a fun thing to see because this is that good. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you when I don't like something. That's not a problem. Okay, well, I'd give <laughs> this a double thumbs up and a nine and a half. Oh, I, this is a ten. This is the best. It really is. This is good. <laughs> <laughs>
Absolutely, it's nine nine five. And look, um, this is five entrees. Yeah. And there's that much left after we've each had a sandwich. So it's this is an abundant. Um, uh, it's an abundant serving. I'm eating still. <laughs> <laughs> and Jenny. Look at that empty plate. Yeah, I'm going back already, so hush. <laughs> it doesn't have that what? The processed taste? The MRE taste, the processy taste. Mm -hmm. mm. We mm. all are having seconds with our buns. Yeah. <laughs> the second yeah. pack of buns is almost gone already. <laughs> so, so we got inspired to, uh, we got inspired to have this because the other day, Somebody went to Arby's, and we got the new King's Hawaiian bun brisket. brisket. Whoa, that was good. But the funny thing is, we weren't sure if we were going to like that one, and so each one of us ordered a second sandwich just in case. And I think we got a lot of the beef and cheddar sandwiches as backups. Um, but those... Uh, that Arby's was really, really good, so that's kind of where we came up with the idea. Oh, this this beats Arby's any day. Arby's was awesome. I'm not an Arby's fan, but that um, brisket was really, really good. This, <clears throat> that just it's so moist mm -hmm. and flavorful. Um, I I could eat this every day. It, this is really good. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, these are chips. It makes me want MRE coleslaw <laughs> and MRE horsey sauce. <laughs> That's a good idea. Oh my God. This is damn good. I've been waiting to try this forever. This is a happy dance. So you two found some leftover horsey sauce. Mm. One packet. <laughs> and you split it, right? Uh, there's still some left. I didn't have enough to put it on. Because I had already eaten most of my sandwich. I had like that much left to put it on. Mm. But it was really good. <laughs> John wants MRE horsey sauce. <laughs> we've had, we've carried MRE mayonnaise. Yeah. But I don't think there's MRE horseradish sauce. Mm -hmm. No. Dear MRE makers. <laughs> <laughs> the epicenter.com. I just want to Cordially my... invites you yeah. to make us MRE horsey sauce. I just want to shout out Chris. I will be doing extra points tomorrow because this was that good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, that's a winner for the epicenter.com. I'm Epicenter Brian signing out. Mm. That's